Previously on Sails and Tails, Tazzy jumped off the side of the boat just to show us how good her doggy paddling skills are. And we took our boat out for the first time for an epic weekend of sailing. So we're enjoying this wonderful, beautiful morning and we got up early because we're delivering um, our fridge today because we have a buyer for it. So we're on our way to the storage unit at the moment and there's like crazy amount of smoke in the sky so uh, we're probably going to have to drive by it because there's like only one way to get through town. So I guess we'll go check that out on the way to the storage unit. It looks as though our local hardware store is gone. Thankfully this happened early in the morning, so no one had showed up for work yet, and therefore nobody was hurt. I have no idea how the two of us got that fridge onto the back of the truck by ourselves, but we did. Sid, aren't you happy that this is going to be the last time that we ever have to lift that fridge? And a Sunday drive through rural North Carolina just wouldn't be complete without stopping for a turtle to cross the road. And you'd think that all that excitement would be enough, but then this happened. What do you have there, baby? I have some money. Money for what? Today we sold our fridge. And we made 600 bucks off of it. And this is going to go into our cruising kitty. This is the first uh, donation. No, not donation. This is the first what? Installment? Installment, yes. This is the first installment into our uh, cruising kitty. So it feels pretty good that we're finally starting to... Uh, save money. Sail away with me tonight. So I came up to Norfolk, Virginia to pick up a port boat and it's 4th of July weekend so I've got to get back to Edenton because my brother and his wife are coming down and we're going to spend a weekend with us. It should be a pretty epic weekend. So looking forward to that. Came with a 3.5 Nissan outboard motor. It fired right up on the first pull. Did you find it on Craigslist? You found it on Craigslist. And you already fired the motor up? Yeah, he had it awesome. set up there. Uh, it was in really good condition. It was laying in his garage. He said he hasn't used it forever. Uh, we pulled it out, put it together, and ran the motor. And gave him the money, and we loaded it on the truck, and here we are. Now we got to find a place to put it. Yep. Because it's one third the size of our sailboat. Show sure is.
can hit your fingers mm, like that. Yeah. Oh, I should hold it on there. After that epic day of sailing, I posted this picture on social media, and our good friend and hiking buddy Bob made a comment and asked, so where's the boom bang? And well, we don't know. So we broke out the owner's manual for a Catalina 30 and tried to figure it out. We don't have the boom bang installed on our boom. It wasn't on there when we got it. So, uh, I found a piece when I was going through the Aflas Red. It may be that. And we don't have this either. Apparently we need some kind of bridle system on our, on our backstay. Well, the bridle system for our backstay is still a mystery to us. We would like to say, thanks Bob. <laughs> without you, we would probably still be sailing without a boom bang. And there's an example of the power of social media and how a friend of ours all the way across the world in Guam helped us out. If you have any advice that you'd like to share, please leave a comment. Or if you just want to tell us how awesome we are, we appreciate that too. So thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.